And we're back, ladies and gentlemen. Most of the people got off, although the two miners that were mining before have gone to sleep. And look at this. Look at the trees. They're back. That means that we can uh, just chop them all up. Get up, guardy. Get your ass up. We're going to go chopping, okay? Wood chopper, go. Be one with the forest. He's going to remove that bush. And then he's going to go on a chopping spree. And these trees will grow back as well, which is the best bit. They won't just disappear forever. And we'll get more seedlings. And we might be able to add more trees to this lovely little stockpile that we have here. This is great because Lewis now won't run out and get killed by a stray wolf. Okay. Nothing crappy like that's going to happen. Look at this. Look at this light little sea right here. That was a random bit of a, a random excitement for a bit of water. But there we go. That's, that's life for you. Okay. A little bit, little bit of excitement. Everything's exciting, guys. A little bit of uh, life there for you. Nice. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. So how are you leveling now, Guardy? What's your level? Because you've been level 5 woodcutting for quite some time now. How much XP do you get for chopping down a single tree? Come on. Show me the money. Eh, about what? 1 15th? <laughs> By the looks of it, at level 5. So it's going to take a little while. He's going to have to chop down a few trees and probably gets a little bit of XP for planting them as well. Hopefully. That'd be really cool. Once again, weird goblin sound coming from this direction. Where is it? It's getting real annoying right now. It might be the chickens, actually. This is a really grimy looking area. I'm not too sure. But oh well. I'll have to ignore it for now. And uh, these two right now have slept for long enough, I feel. I think they need to get up. Get up, you lazy bams. Just move them, I guess. That's one way you do it. <laughs> it's a simpler way you do it. There you go. They're gonna go mining. I think we did make a. I did make a copper axe. Out of something. Uh, I mean copper, not out of something. Out of copper. <laughs> uh, but they still didn't have the ability to mine this or that, which is a bit annoying. Oh wait. They're mining something here. Is it anything good? No. Raw stone. That's it. Just raw stone. Merv is getting kind of excited right now. I'd be getting excited. Wait, what's going on? Oh, right. The mining um, finger jigs may have stopped. Their mining positions, their privileges. Their mining privileges have been taken off. So there we go. Let's just uh, allow their privileges to reign. There we are. And then we'll go up by a layer. And we'll do the same thing here. Beautiful. Now you go. There you go. They're all mining again. Look at that. We have to keep our eye open, actually. Because even though these guys are mining, there's uh, an evil afoot. You can tell by the evil grim music that has now taken place on stage. Ooh. Spooky, 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 spooky. Rain, terror, 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 terror. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> that was weird. What the hell was that all about? <laughs> well, it's evening, it's nice and dark, and uh, the stonemason is not doing anything by the looks of it. Which means that she is finished with the brick, which means she needs to make a uh, hundred more bricks. Or not. No, she's run out of dirt. Oh, this is a disaster. How do you run out of dirt? Well, it's pretty simple how you run out of dirt, but <laughs> there you go. Um, what we need to do is uh, dig up this area here. Um, not that. There we go. And then we'll go down here and we'll stop their uh, current mining orders. So that they will uh, dig up all the dirt and then we can continue to make stuff. So there we go. There's that. And now we'll go up a layer. And we'll do this. There we go. So their order orders have been taken off. Then for some reason they won't mine down there. Which is a bit strange. So well. We'll just take that off then for now. And we'll do the same here. Don't know why they won't mine down there actually. I think it's because they're being blocked off by two materials they can't mine. That's probably what's happening here. So there we go. And now they'll be uh chopping up all of this this lovely dirt right here uh, in order to allow Ismay the powerful um, mining is actually becoming a bit too much of a problem right now, so we need to get back some more storage. 
And we need a, uh, probably another builder's cart. Uh, builder's cart is actually fine. What we need is a, a hay bale. A bundle of wheat straw and hay adds eight mass, say eight mass to the wheat storage capacity. All right, okay. Where the hell is it? Mining stockpile, there we go, I'm missing it. So there we go, let's put it right there. Another mining stockpile always comes in handy. I think you need a carpenter to make that. I'm not really too sure. We will be running out of space soon enough, though, when we mine as much dirt as possible. Look at that. It's a beautiful day. Day is actually over, so not really a beautiful day. Beautiful night is what I was meant to say right there. Ah. The last sip of water. The final water sip. Dun, 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 dun. Dun 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 No. Um, <laughs> what was that all about? That was really weird. Look at all these trees. They're all gonna look- Ah, oh, wood. Wood storage is too high. Wood storage is too high. So what we need is to make another storage area for uh, wood. Wood pile right there. That's, that's in the way of- Wait, that's not a road. What am I doing? I think it will be a road. Oh, of course! We need to make a road there. Like a nice road. What happened? Uh, here. There we are. We'll make a nice road there. I'm not too sure who makes roads. But, um, but someone does, probably. Maybe the miners make roads. They're coming over here. All oh, right, no, but they're not doing anything. How much dirt do we have in storage? Uh, 68 dirt and, uh, 209 raw stone. So we can quite, create quite a large sum of, uh, of bricks. My microphone has moved there, so you're going to hear some sound difference. Differentiation. There we go. Make more bricks. I was about to close the game right there. I do play in windowed because I f just like it. <laughs> I like playing in windowed. That way I can like do stuff in the background. If I quickly need to look up something, I'd have to tab out and everything goes wrong. Because that usually what that is usually what happens when I tab out. Look at that. Beautiful. Need to shake up a little bit. There we go. Get ready. Once again, we hear that weird noise around. These look like graves, actually, when you don't pay much attention. It looks like a, some sort of weird, eerie graveyard. It's not, though. It's not an eerie graveyard, guys. Guys, no. Oh, food and seeds are low again. These people just, like... Okay. Um. Run away. Run away. It didn't pause the game. Run away. Oh, bollocks. Someone else has died because it didn't pause the game. Damn. Chris the Lazy has been slain. More people are dying. I can't sacrifice this many more people, damn it. Oh, God sakes. Where'd that skeleton even come from? <laughs> this is why I shouldn't play in Ultra Max Mega Mode. Because pe people die way too easily on this. They only take one hit and they're dead. <laughs> okay. Um... Well, these two can run back over here, I guess, and they can become archers. Yeah, uh, oh my god. Anyone could be a miner, I guess. It's just annoying that one more person dies. And it's extremely difficult to get more people on this as well. Uh, at least the skeleton is extremely slow, so I don't have to worry too much. Uh, these archers are going to go ga gather their arrows and their bows and that lot, and they're going to go fight this skeleton. There we are. There we go, that's one of them. There we go. Now you can become miners again. Um, so that happened. That unfortunate mess happened. There we go. Let's um, make you into miners again. Miners. Miner, there we go. I hovered over it as well. Didn't really matter. Gather resources. I can't gather resources from dead bodies, unfortunately. Oh man, it's a depressing day. And there's another skeleton down there. That's why we need walls. That's why we need walls. Because they won't spawn inside walls, I don't believe. Uh, light source is required right now. There we are. So, we just got to keep our eye open. Unfortunately, it did not um, spawn. Like, it didn't pause my game the second that something bad happened. So, I think I actually did do that because it's a new client. So, it didn't save my options from before. So, uh, pause the game when enemies are sighted. Damn, it didn't. Uh, pause the game on unit death. Uh, keep lamps lit during daytime hours. Nope. 
allow the game to run in the background nope uh, transparent background for GUI windows nope uh, draw distance should be the furthest actually not too far and uh, yep shadows why is shadows not on uh, we want soft shadows anyway <laughs> anyway that was a thing actually putting shadows on has decreased my frame rate a little bit but anyway there we go. Now it should be able to pause when enemies are nearby that it didn't do before. There we go. That is incredibly depressing because Chris has died, which means we need a new Chris. Uh, Timmy the Boring, uh, Tommy, I mean the Boring, should probably be the new Chris because you did see uh, Chris just get mauled by the, the skeleton bear. It's a skeleton bear, by the way. It was a skeleton bear. No one say otherwise. No one. <laughs> and, and there we go. Hmm. What's going on then? Skeleton there. We need to increase the uh, the walls here. This bit's being mined out. Fun things happening right now. Let's speed it up. And um, let's think about the situation. The lumberjack's not doing anything, so he should uh, probably become a miner too. Just lots of mining, really. I'm just getting tons of mining done. We have loads of space. Uh, we would have four miners now, but unfortunately we have three again. Uh, which I guess is the same amount as before, but okay, I don't really mind too much. At least Lewis the Brave is getting an absolute ton of levels because he's just super experienced. Look how quick these guys are mining through this little dirt field right here. Good things are happening. These trees will be growing soon. Probably want to plant a few more here when we finish with the uh, wall. And we need light sources. We need a large number of light sources and need to be kept lit during the nighttime hours. How's the coal? Um, we're using wood actually, aren't we? Yeah, so that's fine. Uh, coal probably most probably lasts longer and is probably a much quicker um, heat as well. So it probably would allow Thingmajig, Ismay, the powerful, uh, the power I mean, Ismay the power to um, create stuff much quicker is what I'm thinking is what I was trying to say right there but my brain died as it usually does uh, we need to create a wall and we have 108 of these blocks so we should be okay there we are we'll make it along that way and what we'll need to do is uh, continue on this way bad things are happening right now you can tell because of the eerie music music mute 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 music music mute 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 music music, music. Um, what we need is to dispatch the skeleton up there. That's what we need to do. Because we want to go up by a few more layers here and mine out this area. So, um, so yeah. We're going to get uh, an archer. The best archer in the land. His name is Ping Pong Ping. Pong Ping. Apparently not. It's not. It's not. That's incredibly racist. I think. <laughs> I think? Don't know. <laughs> Let's just remove this bit here. There we are, and this bit, excuse me, that was horrible, and we'll uh, chop these stumps down as well. Chop them nice and down, nice and raw, and then we'll turn the uh, the next guy, uh, whoever's the best archer here, shall be turned into an archer. Oh, he's heavily fatigued. The best archer is, uh, okay, we got level 2, level 3, and a level, there we go, so this guy needs to turn into an archer again. Heavily fatigued, god, I really need beds. I gotta think about defense first, okay? Then again, what if something comes and attacks us when everyone's sleeping? At least they all sleep in the center, though. Like, enemies seem to just stray around the edges of our little town right here. Oh, look at that. Let's, like, zoom out a bit right there. There we go. Oh, we can't zoom all the way out because our vision range is not as high as I would like it to be. Uh, there we go. Looks like our archer... I think our archer just fell asleep. No, he didn't fall asleep. Where the hell did our archer go? Let's pause right now. And let's find out where our archer is. Oh, there he is. He's hiding in the darkness. It's fine. Okay, so how many arrows do you have, brave sir? You have good vision as well, which is always nice to have. What I need you to do is display your range and uh, train in archery when near archery target. Wow, that's pretty cool. So inventory... You have eight stone-tipped arrows. That's fine. So what I need you to do is go over and uh, kill this possible threat. 
and any other skeletons that may be nearby. That's what you need to do, good sir. I trust you in all my heart. I believe you are a decent shot. If you're not, then you can just strafe the skeleton because you are very much slightly faster than the skeleton. Uh, move quickly now, however, because you will be face-planted. Face just absolutely raunched. Raunched. <laughs> what am I trying to say? I don't know. I don't even know. So what does that tell you? Right, okay. Battle mode. Activate. Form of. Bow. Okay, nearby. The skeleton has detected you, good sir. Prepare to fire your arrows. Fire! Okay. Completed. Go back. Run away. This is about decent... Okay, about here. This is good. Get ready to fire, good sir. Do not miss. You missed. You absolute dolt. Okay, get ready to fire here again. Ready, sir? Prepare to fire. You missed again. You noob. You absolute noob. You, you make me sick. Okay, you're getting ready to fire again. Don't shoot that tree. Are they too far away for you, good sir? There we go. That's a good shot. Probably too far away. That's probably what the situation was this whole time. Simply too far away. Okay, we'll go here and we'll have another fire. Okay, that was just like bullet point. That was like right in the face and you still missed. Oh wow, the skeleton can take a uh, good couple of hits. Skeletons are not renowned for taking much damage from arrows. Oh, okay, this is good. So, uh, what we want you to do now, good sir, is to become an infantryman and to, uh, to get your infantryman stuff on real quick. Okay, um, uh, <sighs> these guys die way too fucking easily. <laughs> it's very frustrating when your guys die in one shot so freaking easily. That's Jim dead, done, and it's hard enough to build a fucking keep. You can tell I'm legitimately pissed off because he didn't even fight back. And I've lured this skeleton here. Um, hmm. Uh, what the fuck am I going to do now? Uh, I don't know. I guess Ismay the Powerful can lure it away. Something like that. And then I can uh, quickly get my stuff on. Uh, what was my weapon situation? Did I put the armor on? No, he didn't put the armor on. That's probably what, this, what he did wrong there. He didn't put the bronze plate helm on or the iron chainmail on. Uh, which means someone else is going to have to become the infantryman and not bloody die. So it's going to have to be you, Lewis the infantryman. And as for Ismay right here, you can uh, lure the skeleton around a little bit. Yeah, just keep the skeleton nearby. No, no. Don't, don't keep your feelings, okay? Ah, oh, thank God for that. Okay. Alright then. So your inventory does consist of all the stuff that an infantryman would use. Now what I need you to do is to become the town farmer for a little while. Because you're going to need to do all this crop work now because Jim is dead. <laughs> Jim and Chris have died because they were bullshit one-shot kills. Which really needs to be changed. In my opinion, that needs to be changed. Getting one shot is a bit annoying. <laughs> Especially when the archer misses like 11 million times and when just uh, it's just frustrating. It really is. All right. So um, what we need to do is uh, gather resources from this corpse. Gather resources from this one as well. Um, I tried to avoid a death there, but unfortunately the archer was just ultra shitty and I got very unlucky with him right there. That sucks. They need to make it a little easier to get new people, I feel. Making a hall is really difficult. And um, making defenses, because when you make a, a town hall, monsters all of a sudden come out of nowhere. Monsters are hard enough to deal with without having significant archer experience. I mean, wolves are hard enough. I mean, just wow. I'm not looking forward to meeting the dungeon enemies and stuff when I get one shot crapped again. Oh, <laughs> man, you could tell I'm not in a great mood now. Uh, <laughs> I'm a little bit annoyed. I'm still good, but just a little bit annoyed because I think we've only got three more people left now. Uh, maybe four. In fact, no, I think it is literally three people left. Unless there's someone inside that house. Nope, no one inside the house. Anyone inside the mine? No one inside the mine. So, yep, we have three people left now. That's depressing. 
We can't really do too much with free people, to be honest. Apart from order them to do specific stuff, which means Ismay the Powerful needs to stop being a crafter and needs to start doing other stuff. So Lewis the Brave now must become a lumberjack real quick. Um, I, I think we're fine with this many people. Where the frick is... Oh, it's woodcutter, woodchopper. Call it lumberjack, damn it. <laughs> he looks like one. Oh, he's, he moves very quickly right now. RAS because I'm in super speed mode, that's why, obviously. Uh, chopping down... Um, once again, for some reason, not chopping down these, even though I did confirm the chopping down of such things. Maybe I didn't, I'm not too sure. He's going to chop those down, gather the wood from them. I think they actually drop wood, I'm not too sure. Let's find out. Yep, wood logs are gathered from these stumps. Which is pretty cool. Yep, there we go. Unfortunately, they only count as half a log, which is a bit annoying, but oh well. He's going to put them in there, and then he's going to become a miner because I need him to uh, finish off this little area here. And then I need this guy to wake up and start mining. Tommy, you're awake enough as it is. Get up. Get your ass up. Get in action. 